Hello and welcome to my world of crochet. My name is Dean and uh, today I'm here to draw the winner of my current running giveaway video. I have of course a link to that giveaway video um, in the description box down below should you wonder what giveaway that I'm talking about but it is my Christmas inspired giveaway video. And yes, it is getting closer to Christmas. Today is even, at least here in the Northern Hemisphere, the shortest day of the year, which means that slowly the lights will go by there again. Christmas is just around the corner and uh, we will, I guess, slowly be heading into spring. But therefore I decided to have on here my Christmas inspired scarf, which um, I'm quite happy with uh, the outcome, especially after I blocked it. Blocking really made a difference, big time. But we are not here to talk about my Christmas scarf or Christmas or weather or yard time. We are here to draw a winner. And before I'm drawing the winner, I'm just going to quickly go through all the giveaway items, the yarns and the notions that you could win, should you win, basically. Um, and the first yarn you can win is this a Yarn and Colors, 100% recycled acrylic yarn. They are 100 gram skeins, which is three and a half ounces. And for those, you also get 310 meters of yarn, which equals a 339 yards. Um, I have two of these, which is the one in silver, and it's a dialogue one, both of them. Um, so this is silver, and then I have a two here of petroleum. And obviously, yarn specs are the same for both of them. Um, and you should have more than enough to. Um, knit or crochet, depending on size, of course, a sweater or shirt or something like that. Um, it's a medium weight yarn, this yarn, and they recommend crochet hook of four millimeters. I've also personally made blankets in it. It works quite nicely. And for recycled acrylic, you may be able to feel it's recycled, but it feels pretty good. And I think the colors are stunning. The next yarn you can get is definitely the killer stiller of this giveaway, which is this lovely candy star drops cake. Look at this. Isn't this just gorgeous? So we have this lovely blue to a lighter blue to a very light blue to a white that goes in this. And of course we have these dropped um, silver sparkles around the whole yarn. And they do come as indeed a sort of drops because hence the name. There are thicker at some places and other places it's just a quite thin thread. Um, the specs of this cake is that this is a 350 grams. So that's like um, three and a half, seven, ten, eleven some odd ounces uh, to 900 meters of yarn. 900 meters is like 980-ish yards. Um, it's, I do believe, um, 75% cotton and then it's 10 or 15% silk and the other part is Lurex. Um, lovely soft, nice feeling. Of course, you can feel it's slightly less soft where the bigger lumps are with the silver, but generally it's a nice soft. I can imagine the absolute most gorgeous shawls being made from this. So yeah, I'm sure you will be able to figure out to do something nice with this cake. I also always give away the tea that I'm drinking during the giveaway, which during that giveaway was this a winter glow tea. And as you can see, this is also quite Christmas inspired tea. And I think it's gorgeous and it works really nicely with Christmas because it contains cinnamon and it contains um, orange peels. And both are tastes I relate to Christmas, at least where I'm from. So um, therefore, that's how I inspired it. Um, we have the classic peppermints. Get a fresh taste after all your uh, lovely meals. Then we have a scissor, a foldable scissor. So basically, you pull it out at each end and you have a scissor here. Super practical. The golden handles. We have a measuring tape. And this measuring tape has inches on one side and centimeters on the other side, which means that when I talk centimeters, you can easily figure it out if you're in a country that uses inches and opposite. Then I have a little, little pouch here with diverse notions. We have 
three crochet hooks of uh, three, four and five millimeters. They're all on a keychain, so you will not lose your crochet hooks. We have a pin here with a crochet hook and some yarn here. We are crocheting and it is a pin. You can add that to your clothing. We have a two keychains in the shape of hearts. I do consider Christmas a time of the year where we spend time with our families and our loved ones and hearts are simply, you know, a good sign of love. Then we have a couple of uh, labels for clothing. We have a white, we have a golden and we have a silver. And they all say handmade, special edition for you. And then we have two more suede likes and they are also saying handmade with love in blue and a darker blue. That's pretty much it. That um, will be awarded away in this giveaway, should you win. So I hope you like the prizes and I hope you really remember to enter. This time around, you had two weeks to do so because I wasn't home last week. Um, and I'm also going to say this in advance. Um, I will not be able to send you a parcel before after Christmas um, because I simply don't. I, I won't have time to make the post office before I go for all my Christmas stuff. Um, if you send me your email to claim your prize, I will be able to send it the earliest convenience would be Wednesday after Christmas, so next week Wednesday. Um, it's just a heads up. Uh, I'm going to be realistic. So, But if I have information from you, I will definitely make sure it gets shipped Wednesday next week. Um, I entered here in the giveaway random comment picker, the URL for the video, and I'm going to fetch the name. And we did have a keyword this time around because, as I said, we were Christmas inspired. So the keyword here is a Christmas spelled out is O. And I'm going to continue. And we are fetching comments right now. Look. Ta da! We have 115 participants of this giveaway. 115. I'm not sure if that's new record, but it's getting close. Oh, I'm trying to see if I can hold this without. Now I'm gonna press pick a winner. It's not shuffling, it's just directly on, so let's go. And we do have a winner. Congratulations, Judith Butka. Woohoo! Congratulations. So, Judith writes me here. Hello, as always, your giveaway is beautiful. Have a great time while you're away and the best wishes for your Christmas and holiday season. Well, Judith, thank you very much. I am very happy um, to get your Christmas wishes. Actually, I wish you a very Chris very Merry Christmas as well and a Happy New Year. And that goes for everyone, not just Judith who, who won the giveaway. But um, Judith Butka here um, has won our giveaway. So if you weren't out, congratulations. You won. Um, and um, what I need you to do is I need you to email me at buy.muhoi at gmail.com. And I did enter the email address up here. Um, I do apologize, um, but it should be easy to read. That's all you need to type in. If you do that, you should hit me up on my email um, because then we are sure there are no typos and the like. And in that email, I need to know your full name. I need to know your address. I need to know your city and zip code, state, if that's applicable for you, and country of where I'm going to ship this to. I automatically get your email when you email me. So that email address is also what I will be using to send your track and trace code. So you can follow the shipment all the way to your doorstep. Um, depending on where you are in the world, it usually takes anywhere between a few days if you're here in Europe, to um to maybe three weeks if you are across the ocean for me i am in europe as you may know so um that's pretty much it um i need you also to email me no later than the 4th of january 2024 it's almost new year's um because i do reserve the rights to use these prizes for another giveaway or to use them myself um should 
you not contact me in time a lot simply because I can't keep everything stashed away and waiting to be shipped forever. It's I think that's fair enough. Um, so yeah, mail me, mail me, mail me, and a warm congratulations to Judith. Um, and of course, please don't mention her name. It should be a surprise for her when she watches this video that she got to win my a giveaway. Um, I'm absolutely good, looking forward to hear from you, Judith, so that I can get your prize shipped. Um, Tomorrow we also here for a tutorial, a brand new tutorial of mine that is the leafy shawl that will be posted tomorrow at, I do believe it's set for 2 p.m. Central European time. So that will be 8 a.m. Eastern if you are in America. Um, looking forward for your feedback on that one. I hope you do enjoy it. Um, and normally I would be on Monday with a yarn talk video, but it is Christmas. So next week I will maybe do a yarn talk Wednesday. We do not have a new giveaway next week. That will first be in January. Um, also, um, I do have a yarn haul coming up at the end of next week. Um, just for you curious folks. And then, yeah, I wish you a Merry Christmas. I hope you will get to enjoy your time and, uh, if you haven't done it yet, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I could really use a few more Yanni friends and expand my Yanni community. Thank you very much and take care and happy Christmas and uh, yeah, well, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, everything that goes. In Danish, I would say, uh, Glædelig jul and Godt nytår. Bye.